Hopefully I am live. I can't really check on the computer right now since I'm doing this on my phone. But, um, yeah, I was just kind of bored today and I get a lot of people asking me, like, um, which VeggieTales DVDs I have. So I just thought I'd go ahead and do a live stream to show you guys. So I gathered up <laughs> all the DVDs. I could find and uh, yeah put them all in this bin you can see there's a whole lot <laughs> he's trying to move this around for you guys looks like I am live looks like there's a couple people watching so that's good hey man how's it going so yeah these are like in no particular order I just play <laughs> randomly like just tossed them in here so uh, yeah I'm uh, gonna go ahead and start off with the VeggieTales uh, double feature. Already uploaded, uh, you know, clips from this. Got Madame Blueberry and Esther. Not really gonna bother opening up the case because it's really difficult with one hand, so. But uh, yeah, I'm also using my new phone that I got uh, a few weeks ago, so bear with me here. But it should be like better quality though, better uh, video quality. We yeah, have Madame Blueberry, some bonus features. Esther. Um, but yeah, so a lot of users just having all these DVDs in the case. Will I give it away? Uh, no, I don't plan on giving any of these away. A lot of these I, um, these are like all used DVDs, so, <laughs> um, but yeah, so there's really nothing special about them. A lot of them I get are used, um, but yeah. I don't think anybody will want used DVDs. But yeah, we have uh, Mary, Larry, True Light of Christmas. I got this on Christmas. <laughs> got it from my mom. Uh, don't need to upload clips from this, even though it's not Christmas anymore. I'm sure you guys probably wouldn't care too much. Hey, man, how's it going? Um, yeah, I'll probably upload this at some point. Maybe. Oh, yeah, DVD is still downstairs. Okay. No wonder why I felt empty. Um, got Larry Boy and the Bad Apple. You got a message, but I didn't see it. Where did I... I get a lot of my DVDs from a store called, uh, Second and Charles. You can see it right there. A lot of them are from that store. Um, it's pretty much a used, um, store where you can get, like, used books or DVDs, games. That's where I get a lot of my VeggieTales stuff and... Sometimes, um, can you guys hear me? Can you guys hear me okay? Okay, because, okay, someone said they can't hear me, so I don't know what's going on. Does the quality sound good? Audio quality? I'm sorry, I can't pronounce his name, but uh, he says he can't hear me. I just want to make sure that you guys can. Because I'm, re I'm doing this on a totally brand new phone, so. So you guys said uh, audio is good? Okay, to keep going. I know there's like a slight delay. Alright, so I'm just going to head and uh, keep going, so we got uh, another DVD I got for Christmas, this past Christmas, got it from my dad, um, some of the opera, already uploaded clips from here, uh, might do uh, lyric videos soon as well, because I know some of the lyrics is kind of hard to understand, <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll do uh, lyric videos soon. I apologize about the lack of uploading, though, because I might have been a bit distracted playing on my 3DS <laughs> this week. So, yeah, I've just been playing some games. And I also wasn't quite feeling like myself this week, especially yesterday. I had a slight upset stomach. Didn't really feel like doing much of anything, so. But, um, yeah, we got uh, 
Veggie Tales, Dave and Giant Pickle. I think this was a. I think I probably got this on Amazon. I can't remember. Yeah, this is this was from Amazon. So some of them are from Amazon. Others I've had forever. So. Um. Yeah, I, there's a few that I'm still that I still don't own. Like I don't have Beauty and the Beat or a few of the. 90s episodes I'm still missing like um I can't remember which ones there's yeah I can't really think of the name right now of the 90s episode I'm missing I pretty much have like most of the episodes but yeah we have uh, League of Incredible Vegetables got a second and Charles so it's a used DVD um I have one VeggieTales game but it doesn't work on my computer I have uh, Jonah, it's like in my desk right now, and I'm too uh, lazy to get it. <laughs> uh, have I seen High School Babysitter Club? No, never heard of it. Um, we have Veggie, uh, Veggies in Space, The Final Frontier. Really like this episode. I remember showing it to my dad once because uh, the Doctor Who uh, reference, because he really likes Doctor Who. So, uh, yeah, it was kind of a funny moment. Asteroid Cowboys, I think it's a really funny, silly song. You got Veggies in Space for Easter. I got this for my birthday a few years ago, actually. This was a birthday present. I remember how excited I was to get it because I just really wanted to see this episode. Um, of course, you got the uh, very first episode of Where Scott When I'm Scared. Uh, this is the 15th anniversary edition, so 2008. Um, yeah, some bonus features. Um, I'm sorry, but this isn't really one of my favorite episodes, The Penniless Princess. This silly song is really not the best, <laughs> the best friends forever. I I really don't care much about the silly song from meant for, uh, texting. <laughs> but, um, yeah, got this, uh, I think I got this at Second and Charles. Yeah, Second and Charles. It's kind of hard to see because of the tag. But yeah, and this, this really isn't one of my favorite episodes. I mean, I do like the French piece. It's nice to see them not playing a villain like in David and Giant Pickle or some other episodes. It's, it's a really nice change. So, um, Okay, it looks like I forgot to put this back in its case, but it made it so the cute. Search for a Samson's hairbrush. I'm pretty sure I probably had the case in here somewhere. Um, Jonah, VeggieTales movie, my favorite. Without a doubt. Love Jonah. And it's not just because Archie plays a main character. <laughs> uh, what is my favorite VeggieTales movie? Uh, Jonah would be one of them. Uh, Lord of the Beans is another. Um, I like Dave and Giant Pickle. As well, that's a really good episode, in my opinion. Oh, hey, there's the um, one sec, guys. Let me. Did I have like two of them? Oh, yeah, I did get two of them because like a disc was like really messed up, so I must have gotten an extra one. But yeah, here's the case. This other cute. So, um, did I show? Oh yeah, Sweet Pea Beauty. Not a really big fan of this one either. The animation was just so off in this one. And the reason why I haven't really uploaded anything else from this episode because of the DVD itself is really bad shape. I don't remember if it was this DVD. I can't remember if I bought an extra one or not, but yeah, it was... Yeah, you can see the crack. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I haven't uploaded anything else because this DVD just randomly cracked. <laughs> yeah, that um, that explains a lot right there. Which is why I haven't uploaded anything. Yeah, I need to get a new copy. This was used as well, and I did not expect it to be uh such badly cracked. This was um, I got this at Second and Charles, I think, or the thrift store. I can't remember. But um, yeah. Hey, Missionary for Christ, how's it going? It's been a while. Uh, next we have uh, Duke and the Great Pie War right here. I can't really say anything 
about this episode. I haven't really seen enough times to really remember too much. Um, but, uh, yeah. I do like the Blues with Larry. Blues with Larry was a really good one. I, I'll admit, I really like that silly song. Um, doing pretty good. Uh, just been kind of a uh, really weird week for me. Been getting, like, little signs of, like, colds and stuff like that. I had, like, um, Monday had, like, a random stuffy nose, runny nose. Uh, Tuesday had, like, a sore throat. Yesterday, upset stomachs. I don't know what's going on if I might be catching a future cold. But, um, yeah. Got a slight headache today, so I got me some water behind me. Do I ship Larry and Petunia? I don't really have any ships, to be honest. Uh, so, I guess the answer is no. <laughs> But yeah, I don't really care too much for ships, personally. <laughs> but, um... Oh, thanks, uh, Missionary for Christ. I am feeling a little bit better today. It's just a slight headache at the moment. So I got some water. But, uh, yeah, I had the wonderful Wizard of Paws right here. Um, it's a pretty good movie. I can say that. Um, I really like Mr. Lund's version of uh, Over the Rainbow. <laughs> I don't know why. I just really like it. And the Monkey Silly song was funny, I thought. So, beauty's in here. Try about little sniffles. Still have a, um, slight runny nose going on. But, uh, yeah, just, um, this episode was pretty good. Uh, so you have a pistachio here. Um, I think that was also a used DVD. Got it at the thrift store, I believe. So... But yeah. And of course, you have Easter coming up in a couple weeks. It was the night before Easter. Actually, um, <laughs> my uh, dad surprised me when I saw him like a couple weeks ago saying, hold on guys, um, let me see if, okay. I had no idea what just happened. <laughs> I, I don't know why it just randomly stopped, so. Have I seen Cardcatcher Sucker? I've heard of it, but I never really watched it. I don't really watch a whole lot of anime uh, these days, but yeah, I'm somewhat familiar with the name. But I was saying about Easter a few uh, weeks ago when I was with my dad. Um, he told me that Easter was on April 1st this year, and um, April 1st is actually my birthday. So, he surprised me when he told me that, um, my birthday was on, uh, if, on, uh, Easter Sunday. So, I turned 25 on Easter Sunday. <laughs> what was my first Veggie Tales? I honestly don't know because, um, I can't really remember when I first, um, got into Veggie Tales. I mean... This is like one of my oldest DVDs that I have, The Ultimate Silly Song Countdown. This is one of them, and I also have um, the toy that say Christmas VHS and um, Lyle the Kindly Viking. So I can't really say uh, say which one was my Veggie Tale first Veggie Tales DVD because I can't really remember when I first got into it. Um, April 1st is also April Fool's Day. Yeah, it is. Um, I was born on April Fool's Day. Little fact for you guys. But, uh, yeah. Ultimate Silly Song Countdown. Love this episode. I don't really care too much for the hairbrush song. I mean, it's okay to listen to every now and then. But, uh, for my choice, I wouldn't say hairbrush song as number one. <laughs> when I was, um, when I was younger, my favorite was Pirates Who Don't Do Anything. So it's kind of sad it didn't make it to the number one list at the time. And um, if I remember correctly, my mom's favorite was um, Endangered Love. She really loved that one. What is the first anime I've seen? Uh, probably either Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh. The classic Yu-Gi-Oh, of course, was the um, first uh, anime I've seen, I can't really remember, because they both started in the 90s. Hey, Soul Cat, ha Hi, Soul Cat is your favorite song? Yeah, that's a really good one. Um, yeah, the Toy to Say Christmas, that is the second and Charles. Um, so, yeah, 
It's, uh, let's see, what's the year 2002? Um, yeah. Yeah, I had this on VHS as well. I just don't know where my VHS is at the moment. But this is all about DVDs because everybody want to know which DVDs I had. Oh wow, this is already 15 minutes long. See, I told you guys I had a very big collection of Betty Dales. Um, you have St. Nicholas, Story of Joyful Giving. Um, so yeah, not really a whole lot to see. This one is a pretty good episode. Do I like Pokemon? Yes, I do. Even though I don't really watch the series all that much these days, I still enjoy playing the Pokemon games. Um, I'm kind of sad they're not making any more Pokemon games for the 3DS and they're moving on to the Switch. Which, I do not have a Switch, so... I don't know if I'll get one. Maybe. Possibly. In the future, I might get one depending on what the new games are like. Um... But, uh, I still need to get Ultra Sun. <laughs> I still need to get Pokemon Ultra Sun. The, uh, last episode of Pokemon I watched was the, uh, uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon episode with Misty and Brock because, you know, 90s nostalgia. And I really love that they, um, brought Jigglypuff back for that episode. It was just so hilarious. <laughs> Seeing how everybody thought Jigglypuff was all cute and everything and Ash, Misty, and Brock were just freaking out because they know it was that same Jigglypuff that would... Uh, try and sing to them and they will always fall asleep about it. So I, I just really love that um, So here you have uh, VeggieTales, Rack Shack and Benny um, Love this episode really good really good episode lots of songs in here um, See he's got a sticker kind of uh, blocking everything but uh, yeah second and Charles this was used So pretty much most of the stuff that says second and Charles they were all used uh, DVDs. All the episodes from the 90s you have on VHS. Uh, yeah, I only have like one VeggieTales VHS, which like I said is, um, uh, Toy That Say Christmas. So, um, here you have the Pirates movie, which of course a lot of people say wasn't that good, but it's alright. It's, um, it has its moments, I'll admit. Um, so, but, uh, yeah, I still find it really funny how they got an anime voice actor in here. Uh, what's my favorite Pokemon? Um, I always have a soft spot for Pikachu because my first game was, uh, Pokemon Yellow. But, um, I really love Lucario, Jolteon, and Umbreon. And I love Keldeo as my favorite legendary. Um, so yeah, those are some of my favorite Pokemon. I know it's kind of weird uh, group there, but I really love those Pokemon. Um, here you have VeggieTales Live. I remember somebody wanted to request me to upload clips from this, but I'm just a little nervous about, you know, YouTube wanting to take this down. So, have I seen Miraculous Ladybug? I've heard of it, but it just doesn't really seem like my kind of show, so I didn't really, it just didn't seem interesting to me, so I haven't really watched it. So, um, yeah. But I, I know what you're talking about. I've heard of the show. Um, here you go. Another Easter episode. Easter Carol. Hey, CCA Production. How's it going? But, uh, yeah. Easter Carol. I'm so glad I put all of these in a bin. This is so nice. I love these bins so much. My mom got me these. For, like, my birthday. Oh, no, not birthday. Christmas. A few years ago. So, this is really nice. Ever seen Little Witch Academia? I probably pronounced that wrong. Um, no, I haven't. I haven't heard of it either. Um, but then again, I don't really watch a whole lot of TV, so yeah. Yeah, I have Easter Carol. Really love this episode. Really funny, in my opinion. Um, here you have uh, Snoodle's Tail, right here. I think I got this. Oh, nope, second of Charles. I was about to say, um, that there's. Or was it this door or was it second? I can't remember. A lot of tags are always the same, so it's really hard to tell. But uh, yes, yeah, Noodle's Tale. So it's, um, I like the silly song in this one, the Sports Utility Video Cool. I thought that song was really funny. Um, Little Drummer Boy, I had the DVD 
probably downstairs. I think cause sometimes I watch it, so it's a really good episode, I think. Do I live in Canada? I do not. I don't live in Canada. I live in the United States. But, um, April's uh, Foods of Christmas is a really good silly song. Um, but, uh, yeah. Uh, Days of the Cucumber. Definitely got a second Charles. Took a while to find this. I remember somebody kept requesting me to upload this until I, you know... It's really hard. It was really hard to get on Netflix, and it took a while to be able to find this used. So, yeah, it's the cucumber. Um, are you my neighbor? I was so excited when I finally found this because I've been trying so hard to rent this from Netflix, and um, yeah, I never had any luck because it was always like under a long wait. So, yeah, I was so happy when I finally found this at the thrift store. What was my first Pokemon game? Pokemon Yellow, without a doubt. Pokemon Yellow was my first Pokemon game. I have it on my um, 3DS now, actually, since they are bringing back the classic Pokemon games. For the 3DS and Nintendo eShop, so yeah, I bought it. Do I have Netflix? Yes, I do. I do have Netflix, and I watch some movies on there, some shows. In fact, tomorrow I am going to be watching... Um, this Netflix series called uh, Spirit Running Free, um, which came out uh, summer of last year, I think. And they're about to release season four tomorrow, so I'm going to be distracted watching that. <laughs> uh, Spirit Running Free, if you guys don't know what it is, it's um, a sequel, supposedly, to the original Spirit Style in the Cimarron movie made by DreamWorks, which is supposed to be about um, Spirit's son. So, um, but yeah, it's a really good series in my opinion. I thought it was really good and I enjoy watching it, so. But, uh, yeah, here's the Ballad of Little Joe, Lesson Facing Hardship, really good episode as well. Like, the, the boys in the sink. <laughs> um, but yeah. Um, uh, let's see. Uh, Betty Tells How to Draw, got this at the uh, Second and Charles. The really... It was actually really funny, a funny story about this. Um, just a few days before going to that store, I had actually added this to my Amazon wish list, and um, <laughs> my mom took me to Second Charles a couple days later. It was like for my birthday, yeah, if I remember correctly, it was for my birthday, and um, I was looking at the DVDs, just trying to find any new Veggie Tales, and this was actually, you know there so I was like all surprised and I grabbed it as soon as I saw it so that's how I got this it's like second and Charles knew what I wanted that day and legs are getting a little uncomfortable okay so um moving on to one of my older DVDs here uh Vile the Kindly Viking with the silly song Larry's High School Cat so um really good episode really love this one no. What's my oh what's my favorite sport? Um I don't really play a whole lot of sports, but if you want to count it, um I do bowling. Bowling is my favorite thing to do. Um I was in two different leagues in high school. Um because I loved it so much I did a high school league on Thursdays afternoon, like right after school was done. My dad would uh, drive me to the bowling alley. Um and I did one Saturdays, so um, I, there was I did this youth league on Saturdays, which was really fun. Got a few trophies back there. You can see some bowling trophies that I won. Shakira, you like a uh, spear on your free? That's awesome. It's nice to meet another person like spear on your free. Bowling and Wii Sports. So. Oh yeah, I used to do a lot of bowling on Wii Sports. I love that. I used to do that a lot. But uh, yeah, my old like, kind of biking good episode. Um, uh, trying to organize everything here. Uh, here you have Heroes of the Bible, which is three different episodes. Uh, it was David and Giant Pickle, Esther, and um, Daniel and Lion's Den. Um, what's my favorite ice cream? Uh, there's this flavor that I really like to get at the shoppers called a uh, waffle cone, which is pretty much like um. 
vanilla ice cream with some caramel and some little bits of waffle cone and some chocolate bits as well. It's really good. I love the waffle cone flavor. But uh, yeah, you have a uh, here's the Bible. See, is it? Not sure if I were upload anything on here, but yeah. Bowling is a Wii Sports, so that counts. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I used to do um the Wii Sports bowling a lot. Got my Wii over there. You can see a uh, Pokemon Game Boy Color there as well, which I'll probably get in a few minutes. Um, so, got the Robin Good and It's Not Summer Men. Love the songs on this episode. I thought that was really good. Um, really love the bubble rap. I think that's probably one of my favorite silly songs. I don't know why. I just really like it. Bubble rap. Um, another... You have a Sherlock Holmes Golden Ruler. Um, also used. Ah, so hard to keep everything from falling over. Um, there's probably some bonus features I haven't uploaded yet. So, yeah, I might try and see if there's anything I need to upload. I know I uploaded the veggie commentary. So, we'll see if there's anything left I need to upload on this DVD later on. But, uh,. Yeah. Um. Have I heard the educational books? That was the question I asked. Sorry, it's like I'm recording this on my phone, so the way lighting works on your cell phone is a little different compared to um doing it on the computer. I don't think I have heard of it. So your little brother watches my veggie tales. That's pretty cool. That's really cool to know. Uh, here we have uh, Gideon, another favorite episode of mine, mainly because it's really awesome to hear uh, Bob actually do a silly song, the uke ukulele karaoke. Yeah, this is a really good episode. I also really love the uh, the Great I Am song that Paul sings, Paul Great. But the, yeah, this is a really good episode in my opinion. Oh, <laughs> you're singing the Spirit Ring Free theme song. <laughs> Um, here we have the I Can Be Your Friends, uh, sing-along from Second and Charles. It's, the case itself is kind of in bad shape. The, um, the paper is kind of torn. But then again, it's kind of what you expect from US DVDs. But, uh, the DVD itself was in really good shape, so as long as the DVD is in good shape, then I don't really care all that much. Um... What type of consoles do I have? I don't have a whole lot. I have a Wii, a Super Nintendo, you can see over there. I have an N64 in that bin right there. You can't really tell because there's a whole bunch of other stuff inside it. Um, I have, I don't know if you can consider it a console, but I have a 3DS as well that I play. But, um... Yeah, I don't really have a whole lot of consoles. That's usually my brother's thing. He's kind of the big gamer of the family. He has tons of consoles. <laughs> really hard to keep track of them. Uh, this is my most recent DVD that I got. Um, say a couple weeks ago. It was like maybe last week or the week before. I can't remember. I was uh, with my dad. He took me to Second and Charles. And I got this DVD. Which I uploaded one of the how to draw stuff on my channel yesterday. Don't need to upload the other one, which I've already recorded. Should I um, upload Bob's Vacation on this channel? I don't know if I should. Do I have a pet? Um, not really, unless you want to count virtual ones. I would um, love to have a cat, though, because I, my mom and I really love cats. But, um... Pretty much the deal is that whenever we buy a house, we um we plan on getting a cat. Think about getting two cats because we love cats. <laughs> so um, yeah, we don't currently we don't really have a pet. I have virtual pets though. Um so yeah. So uh, here you have Princess and a Pop Star, which is probably the only girl centric, uh, girl themed episode I really like. Um, but, uh, yeah. It was, it was pretty okay. I liked it better than Sweet Beauty, that's for sure. Um, 
I was still happy when I saw this. Because these were like the two episodes I was missing for Larry Boy because I had League of Incredible Vegetables and um, The Bad Apple. So these were like the only two I needed. So I was so happy when I saw this. What's my favorite horror movie? I don't like horror, so I don't really watch any horror movies. <laughs> Can I sing the Spirit Ring Free theme song? I don't really sing personally, so. <laughs> Which is a little weird because um, I used to be in choir for like nine years from kindergarten to ninth grade. So, but uh, yeah, I was so happy to find this. Uh, yeah, two DVDs and one. Um, here you have the Star of Christmas. Can't really say much about this episode. Haven't really seen enough times to really say if I like it or not. But, um, yeah. Do I have Bridget Tales Sing Along Sinemushu and I Love My Lips? No, I do not. Sorry. I don't have those. Um, here you have, uh, Ava Amazing Promise. Yep. See, things are sitting out of my hands. Um, I thought this silly song was really funny. Just needs if you need to. I thought that was really funny. So. See, look how big this pile is getting. It's crazy. Actually, there was something I just remembered about um, one of my VeggieTales DVDs. I'll show it to you later. You'll give me $100? Nah, not even for $100. I don't really sing. Um, here you had the big, uh, big river rescue. So, pretty good episode, I guess. Um, don't really know too much about it. At least I really like it because the biscuit says Miranda Bell. It's just really awesome to see Archie do a silly song. So unlike him. So, that was really cool that they had Archie do that. Um, this here is also one of my older DVDs, um, Josh and the Big Wall. Do I have Fortnite? I'm not really too familiar with what Fortnite is. I've heard of it, but I'm not familiar with it. But, um, yeah, this is like my older DVDs. Had this thing forever. I remember there was a time where I kind of lost it, but, uh, yeah. I really like this episode. Um... Here we have It's a Meaningful Life. My mom actually really liked the uh, movie It's a Wonderful Life. She really liked this movie and I told her how they had a VeggieTales version of it. So. Um, oh, here's uh, another uh, Miss so Cute Search for Simpsons hairbrush DVD case. This is probably the one that DVD, this DVD, yeah, here we go. We found the DVD case. For at this DVD thing, wherever it is, I don't know anymore. Um, here you have uh, Lord of Beans, one of my favorite episodes. Love this episode for some reason. Did I see the movie coming to America? Never heard of it. I don't really watch a lot of movies either. Although I am looking forward to the um Christopher Robin movie and um. Mary Poppins Returns. I am looking forward to those two movies. But, uh, yeah. Uh, Lord of the Beans. I see a lot of people requesting uh, Beauty and the Beep to be uploaded on my channel. The thing is, is that I don't own it. That's like one of the few modern episodes I don't have, so. Um, here you have King George and Ducky. I really love this episode, for sure. I don't know why, but I just really like it. Um... And it has my mom's favorite silly song, and Danger Love. But, um, yeah, King George and Ducky, a really good episode. I need to clean up later. You had the original 2005 DVD of Florida Beans. That's pretty cool. I say I don't know what... I have, like, two Lord of the Bean copies with different covers, which is really weird. Let's see, what was this one? Um... This is the 2009. So, yeah, like I said, I have two of them. Let's see, is that one? Yeah, here's the other. This is the other Lord of the Beans that I have with different, like, um, cover. So, let's see, this is 2005. 
There you go. I wonder why the covers are so different. Hold on, let me see if I can try and... So I have 2009 and 2005. I'm going to try and put them side by side. So yeah, this is 2009. This is 2005. This one, I think I got as a present. And of course, this one's from Second and Charles. So yeah, 2009 on the left and 2005 on the right. So now I know why the covers are so different. <laughs> um... So we're kind of nearing the bottom of the pile here. We have the wonderful world of autotainment. Got this at Second of Charles. Ah, sorry about that noise. Um, has some really good songs in here, which is pretty cool. Will I watch the Slender Man movie? No, I don't really do anything with Slend uh have nothing to do with Slender Man. I don't really watch that kind of stuff. Let's see all the VeggieTales DVDs that you have. Had a 2009 cover. Oh, okay. Do I like reptiles? Um, not really. <laughs> Although I remember in um, elementary school we had this assembly. Someone had like um, brought in an iguana and um, this really big yellow snake actually. And we got a chance to, towards the end of the assembly, I remember all of us were able to walk up to the stage and like you know, pet the animals for like a quick second. It was really, it was actually kind of terrifying petting a snake. The only, um, uh, the only time I will ever pet a snake. <sighs> um, okay, so here you have the Silly Night Fever. Really, really love this episode. I don't know why I just really love this episode. It's one of my favorite ones as well. Um, Perfect Puppy, Silly Song, uh, starring Terry Crews as voice of Bruce Onion. I thought Bruce Onion was a really cool character in this show. Have I seen VeggieTales in the house? Yes, I have um, seen both in the house and in the city. And I think they're okay, but uh, some of the designs just don't sit well with me. Like um, uh, Laura's design. Not a really big fan of her design at all. Was uh, God wants me to forgive them the episode you're missing? Uh, yes, that is the one. Thank you, Ian. That was the one I was thinking of. I did not have that 90s episode. And I don't have Beauty and the Beat either. But, um, yeah, here's the last one, Happy Together DVD. So that's, uh, pretty much all of my VeggieTales DVDs. There's a whole bunch of them in here. Did I see the Jumanji movie? I am familiar with it, but I haven't really watched it. Is that the one with Robin Williams in it? I miss Robin Williams so much. I love Robin Williams growing up. He was like a big part of my 90s childhood with Flubber and all that stuff. Um, oh yeah, there was something I wanted to show you guys once I put the um, uh, DVDs away here real quick. Just so it's less of a mess. Yeah, those are pretty much all the DVDs I have currently. I don't know if I'll be getting more for my birthday, but who knows. They had the Pokemon Tournament Deluxe for the Switch. Oh. Yeah, I've heard about the Pokemon Tournament. It looks pretty cool, but, um, yeah, I don't have a Wii U and I don't have a Switch or anything like that, so I can't really play them. My dad's been talking about maybe getting a Switch for me, but I don't know. I mean, is it really worth getting a Switch? Nintendo Switch? I don't know. What do I do with this case? I kind of just keep them. Really. I don't really uh, sell my duplicates. I don't know how I was able to get all these episodes in here in the first place. Um, okay, so many DVDs. It was all neatly organized before. Sorry about the camera movement. Just trying to put everything away so it's, you know, not so messy in here. Um... But yeah, there was something I wanted to show you guys in the boss, the Pirates movie. And I thought this was just really funny for some reason. So I kind of know this is very recently, but when I opened this up... Wait, is it still in here? Was it the Pirates movie? Or did I take it out? Darn it. One of the DVDs had like a, um... 
I know it was one of my DVDs. I can't remember which one it was. One of my DVDs had my like movie ticket, which I thought was really funny. Can't remember which DVD it was, but it had like a movie ticket for the pirates. How many veggie toast do I have? I have way too many to keep count. There was like one DVD that had um a ticket, movie ticket to um the pirates movie. It probably could have been um the Big River Rescue DVD. I have to double check on that. I had a picture of it on my phone though. I remember showing it to some friends on Skype about it because I thought it was really weird. But yeah, now I can't really find the Big River Rescue. It's really hard to... Oh, here it is. Wait, was it this DVD? I can't... Nope, not this one either. Darn it. Hey, there you go. I decided to, um, cut out again. Do I play Pokemon Go? Yes, I do play Pokemon Go. I'm um, level 25. I'm on Team Instinct. So I might consider changing the team because, um, was it one of the double feature DVDs? Maybe. Probably. I remember talking about it on the uh, Skype group. About finding it probably could have been, uh, let's see, is it this one? Yes, it is. Thank you, Ian. You saved me here. Yeah, see, here's the ticket. <laughs> this is what I want to show you guys. So, anybody want to go to the movies? <laughs> Thank you, Ian. You saved me right here. So, yeah. This is what I wanted to show you guys. This was just hilarious. <laughs> when I first saw this, I was just cracking up for some reason. I know the ticket's like 10 years old. This is... It is just so funny when I saw it in there. Do I play Skylanders? Nah, I don't. You're on Team Mystic? That's pretty cool. I was kind of considering maybe joining Team Mystic just because my favorite color is blue. <laughs> but um, I joined Team Instinct because my dad was playing Pokemon Go with me for a little while. So I joined Team Instinct to uh, play with him. So that way we can like take gems over together. So uh, yeah. Yeah, here's like Pirates uh, movie in theaters January 11th. So um, yeah, this was... I thought this was just really weird. And funny at the same time. So. Anyway. Uh, yeah, if you guys were curious about my consoles. But, uh, yeah, you have Wii over there. This is my, um, 3DS right here. It's got Tatalia on it. Because I love Tatalia. It's my favorite anime. Do I have Pokemon Sun and Moon? Yes, I do. I have Pokemon Moon. Uh, same reason why I joined Mystic. My dad is on a team of Pokemon. Oh, yeah, so. You, you know how it is. Then, CCA Productions, you know how it is. I've been, um, distracted playing, uh, Metopia this week. I got this game for Christmas. I've been trying to, like, finish it. I'm very close to, very close to finishing this game. Um, but yeah, I love my 3DS. I might... I kind of want a new one though, new 3DS, get the new 3DS XO, SNES edition, so, so I can play um, some of the classic games, and you can only do it on a Nintendo, on any uh, 3DS XL. Can't wait to play that game, yeah, it's a really fun game, I, I definitely recommend it. Do I like anime? I think this kind of helps uh, show that. <laughs> this kind of helps answer that question. I love anime. I got uh, Hitalia on my 3DS. I got a Yu-Gi-Oh poster. I got a Fullmetal Alchemist poster. Hitalia poster. Got some anime plush toys Pokemon and uh, Edward Elric from uh, Fullmetal Alchemist. So uh, yeah, I, I like anime. Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon. I do not have Ultra Sun and Moon. I have um, just Plain old Pokemon Moon. I want to get Ultra Sun though for my birthday, hopefully. Um, is there anything you guys want to see in my room? There's like not a whole lot to see, honestly. Is there anything you guys want to know about while I'm live streaming? If I can go 
anywhere around the world to live, where would you live and why? Um, I'm not sure. Um, probably England, maybe, or Japan. I don't know. Hello, Jonathan. Um, but, uh, I really like the history in England. Like, all those castles. Love to, um, love to visit them. I know my mom really wants to visit the UK someday. My brother actually lived in England for a little while. Do I plan on getting any foreign VeggieTale DVDs? I don't know, honestly. I haven't really thought about it. Um, okay, so... I want to see my games here. Sorry if I'm in the camera so much. Do I have any Scooby-Doo DVDs? Yes, I have. Most of the classic ones, most of the early 2000s stuff and late 90s. I have a few of them. Here's... Um... Some right there, I got Scooby-Doo, Globetrotters, Scooby-Doo, uh, Cyber Chase. Do I have, uh, no, I do not have any of those. I don't have 3 to 1 Penguins or the Cartoon Adventures. If I see any DVDs of the Cartoon Adventures, I will, um, get them. But I'm not really a big fan of 3 to 1 Penguins, I'll be honest with you. But yeah, here's some Sonic games. Yeah, Sonic DX Adventure Director's Cut. Um... Some Sonic Unleashed. I've been playing a lot of Sonic games lately. Um, here's my old uh, Pokemon Game Boy Color. I wanted to show you guys earlier. It has a old Game Boy in there. Game Boy game. Um, but I'll show you guys how it works. I don't know if you guys heard that or not. But yeah, it works. Do I plan on uploading any VeggieTale commentaries to Google Drive or... Uh, I don't really have Google Drive, so probably not. But yeah, this is my, um, old Pokemon Game Boy Color. If I can dye my hair any anime color, what color would you do and why? I don't really know, honestly. You gotta call my, got to call your mom and, okay. Um... Some more anime stuff, Italia pillow that my mom got me. Not last Christmas, but the Christmas before, but this was like a late Christmas present. Um, another little Italia pillow. Sorry, my bed's a mess. Um, there's my laptop over there. Yes, I do love anime. I, I even though I don't really watch it as much as I used to, I, I love to watch the classic stuff. I got this, um, from the Alchemist poster. Last summer, my uh, dad took me to my first anime convention called um, Otakon. It was in D.C., which is not far from where I live. So, uh, yeah, he took me there, and I got a chance to uh, meet my favorite anime voice actor, Vic Mignogna. It was just so awesome <laughs> being able to talk to him. Even if it was just for a second, I was just so excited, so... He actually held that poster as well. When my dad took a picture of the two of us, he and I held that poster. So, that was just a really cool moment. So yeah, here's my Italian poster again. Some anime plush toys in there. Some stuffed animals. Can I play games on my channel? I don't really know. I mean, most people kind of expect to see Veggie Tales. Um, I mean, I've played a few Veggie Tale games on my channel. It's only, it really depends on what you guys want to uh, see me do. It really depends if you guys don't mind me uploading games. Maybe I might consider doing live streams. Live, uh, live stream games with friends like CCA Productions. Um, but yeah, this is kind of pretty much a good view of my room. I do actually have a game channel. But uh, here's the windows outside. It's nice and sunny outside. I have a game channel called the Cloud Heart Games, which I'll leave uh, the name of it in the description after the stream is over. But uh, yeah, there's my uh, bowling trophies. It's called the Cloud Heart Games. It's all one word. Like, like I said, I'll leave a description. I'll leave a link to it after the stream is over. Here's my first place of bowling trophy when I was in the league, 2007-2008. Really proud of that trophy. I won three trophies in my first bowling year. My first year of the bowling league, I was so happy. 
Here's another one that I won, Coach's Award. And uh, here's another one, High Series Handicap. But I'm, I'm really proud of these trophies. I actually have two Coach's Award. Here's um, here's another one, 2009, 2010. But yeah, that's pretty much um, my room. What's my favorite Ready to Sing Along DVD and video? Um, I don't know. I mean, I only have a couple sing alongs, so I can't really say. Really. But yeah, I have. I decided to keep all the Ready to Toast I currently own in this bin because it's nice to have them all in one place. So, but yeah, this is my messy room. Hope you guys don't mind that. I have some great awards. Thanks. Thanks, Dexter. Welcome back, Jonathan. Do I have any brothers or sisters? I have um one older brother who doesn't live with us. He lives like a couple hours away from us currently. I'm trying to think about if I should take out my tripod here. But then that would just require a lot of camera movement. This is the tripod I used for those old um speed drawing videos. This is the brand. My mom got this for my birthday last year. Um, that's kind of also another reason why I wasn't like really um, uploading anything this week because I was busy on my gaming channel. Well, language I don't really know English to be honest. <laughs> I don't really have like any um. I don't really know any other languages. I like to learn Japanese though. I would really love to learn Japanese. But uh, yeah, here's a good look at my tripod here that my mom got me for my birthday so um yeah I stream a couple games on my gaming channel I stream Roblox sometimes um I've recently been streaming this Pokemon game called uh, Pokemon Brick Bronze on Roblox only done two of those streams um but yeah you found some Japanese Be VeggieTales videos that's pretty cool you have a similar tripod you use for gaming. That's nice. Yeah, I really like this tripod. It's really good. It's very sturdy. So, um, I'm not sponsoring anyway. Um, but yeah, here's kind of what looks like a nice mini tripod. Kind of just like, um, it's really hard to do this one one hand. But yeah, it's really, I was so surprised that my mom got me this. This is a really cool birthday present. Are you able to put a shelf for No, not really, because we're renting this house. This is a rental house, so no, we can't really do any shelving at all. I do have Pokemon cards. I'm surprised you haven't asked that already. Um, here, hold on, let me get it. This is, like, super, super old. Oh, jeez, this is heavy, too. Um, sorry, I'm, like, sitting on my bed right now. <laughs> Uh, yeah, this used to be my brother's, actually. So, yeah, we would keep our Pokemon cards, um, in this binder. So, you can see how old it is. Do I have any VeggieTales VHS or just... I only have one VeggieTales VHS, which is the, uh, Toy to Say Christmas. So, yeah, here's the Pokemon cards. Some of them are very, very old, you can tell. Just from the designs and the way the cards look. Some of them are very old. Um, some of them are new that I put in there, but yeah, pretty much most of them are old. And like, what year is the VHS? Um, I can't remember. It's like, it's not the original one. I can tell you that. It's not the original tape. It's, um, I really can't remember what year it was. I don't even know where the, uh, box is. The VHS box Okay, here's like, um, here's one of my favorite Pokemon, Jolteon, right there. I love Jolteon, it's my favorite evolution, along with Umbreon. But it's easy to tell which ones are the old Pokemon cards. Do I have any X's or, wait, what? 1998, yeah, I probably think it was probably, um, 1998, I don't know. Okay, here's, um... Is it Lyric or... It's Lyric. I yeah, I believe it's Lyric. I remember... I have a video of it up on my channel. You have to look for it, though. That I, re I um recorded a clip of it from my phone. But I believe I have it up on my channel. 
You just have to look for it. Yeah, here's like all the um Pokemon cards and stuff. Very old binder. I'm not sure honestly how long this stream is gonna be because my phone is feeling kind of warm. Sorry, this is, I was like feeling my phone, but yeah, it feels a little warm. So I'll probably let it run another 10 minutes if you guys want to ask me some questions, feel free to. Since I know some of you guys probably missed out on the last Q&A because it was like a last minute uh, stream. Do you have any Pokemon event? Uh, no, I don't really do any events. I'm not like a major Pokemon battler. Um, oh man, please don't tell me this thing is ruined. Uh, see, this is why I don't open it very much because it's old and... Uh, Oh, it might be just because of, yeah, it's just because of this thing, I hope. You can tell how old this thing is. It won't close. I have to take care of that later. Um. Yeah, it's like really, really old. There you go. It closed. That'll show you. Binder. But, uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions you want to ask me for maybe a few more minutes, feel free to. Um. Should I put my phone on my tripod so that way you have something to look at besides just my tripod? <laughs> um, kind of a last minute decision here. Yeah, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask me. I'll stream for a few more minutes. It could be anime, anything related to VeggieTales or any other interests that you guys might want to know about me, so. Uh, favorite movie? Um... I really love the uh, Emperor's New Groove, and I also really love Mary Poppins. Of course, they're both Disney movies. So, yeah, those are two of my favorite movies. Emperor's New Groove, I find to be a really funny movie. I also really like Hoodwink. Hoodwink is really good, too. So, but yeah, those are a few of my favorite movies. How many Z Crystals? Do I have in your in my Pokemon Moon? I don't remember actually. I haven't really touched it in a while. So I want to put my phone on my tripod, but I don't want it to move too much. You know, I don't want to shake the camera too much unless you guys don't care that much. <laughs> I think it might be easier. Oh, my glasses cleaner. Yeah. He's, um, probably show you guys my 3DS games, I guess, some of them anyway. Some that I downloaded. Hey, you can see me holding my phone. What's up? What's up, people? But yeah, this is my uh, 3DS. I got the Sonic 25th Anniversary. Um, do you, do I want you to do a tutorial video on recording 3DS footage with a tripod? Um, you don't have to, but, uh, I mean... You can if you want to, but yeah, this is um, kind of my 3DS right now. Sonic the Hedgehog has invaded my 3DS. I blame CCA Productions. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Seriously, my friends are the ones who got me back into Sonic. CCA Productions, you especially, got me back into Sonic again. So thank you for that. <laughs> I don't know why I ever stopped uh, playing Sonic anyway. I really don't know why. See, I grew up with the original Sonic, the classic Sonic games. I'm like totally new with this Sonic. I The only attachment I really have with this Sonic is like from Sonic X. And of course I really love Sonic Boom series. I just love all the fourth wall breaks. That show is so hilarious. But um, yeah, I got some demos. Got Sonic Lost World on here. All Star Racing. I still had the Metopia demo on here for some reason. I bought um, myself uh, Sonic Generations. Pokemon Yellow right here. Do I have Super Smash Bros. Brawl for the Wii? I do not, but I would love to because Lucario is in it. <laughs> Sorry, Lucario is my favorite Pokemon. Is that Larry Boy double feature? Yep, it is. Can I zoom in on here? Let me see. Yes, I can. I can zoom in. It's, um, fit from outer space in a river weed. Yeah. Yeah, these are just some of the games I have on my 3DS. I got Netflix on here. Nintendo eShop. YouTube. Um. 
no problem. And of course, that Metopia. Oh, if you guys uh don't know about this already, they added something new to YouTube. They added a um a uh, live chat replay. So like once the stream is over and you end up clicking on the video again, like an hour later, let's say, um, you'll be seeing the live chat being replayed. So you'll be seeing who was talking. So which is, I guess, that's kind of helpful. But uh. Yeah, I'll also make sure to leave a link to my gaming channel in the description if you guys want to check it out. You're welcome to. Um, probably something else you don't know about me. Or probably do. I'm a huge Muppet fan. I have a Kermit the Frog uh, bag here that I got at Walmart not long after the um, Muppets Most Wanted movie was released. Um, I got some Fraggle Rock stuff. I got the... Kermit plush toy that my mom got me a few years ago for my birthday. Made by Ty, of course. Favorite Muppet? Uncle Deadly, without a doubt. I love Uncle Deadly. I love Uncle Deadly, Kermit, Rolf, Gonzo. Those are some of my favorite Muppets. And of course, you got Wimbley from Final Rock. I really want to get gold, though. My um, dad got me this for Christmas a few years ago. He got me into Fraggle Rock because he liked it. His favorite was uh, Uncle Traveling Matt. And my favorite Muppet is Gobo. I love Gobo. <laughs> Maybe because he's voiced by Jerry Nelson. Jerry Nelson is my favorite puppeteer. So, But uh, yeah, I love Muppets. I kind of consider myself a Muppet nerd. Um, have a few DS games over here. Um, Gonna move this GameCube controller out of the way. I got... Uh, Sonic Boom, Fire Nights, which I was able to complete. Do I watch Bear in a Big Blue House? I'm familiar with it. I probably watched it when I was younger, but I don't now. Um, got a few things over here. Let's see what's this. Um, Super Smash Brothers Melee for the uh, GameCube. And Pokemon Battle Revolution. Sonic Boom Shattered Crystal. I'm still stuck on this game. It is such a pain to find all those crystal shards. <laughs> Why Sega? Why? Oh wait, no. Is it Sega? Yeah, Sega. Why would Sega make us do this? I can't do anything with Shadow if I can't find any crystal shards. That is like pure torture right there. But yeah, Fire and Ice I was able to complete within a couple days. But not Shadow Crystal though. Um... But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I can really show you for games and things like that. Whoops. I kind of forgot the band was behind me. Almost tripped. That would have been bad. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to know about me, I guess. I love Sonic. I love Muppets. love anime. Um, favorite is Italia. Love this anime. Highly recommend it. But, um... I would appreciate that very much if you do a, a playthrough. I cannot find the, those crystals. I mean, I have looked everywhere like so many times in some of the levels and I'm still missing some. I would really appreciate it if you can do that for me. But yeah, the crystals, the crystal shards are just really hard to find. I can't remember how far I got either um, in the game. I have my game put away right now, otherwise I would show you, but yeah. Hey, what do you know? I decided to cut itself off again. Might as well go ahead and show you me right now, I guess. But, uh, yeah, since this seems to be cutting off so much, um... Actually, I'm going to go ahead and, yeah, because I don't look that great. Since this keeps cutting off, I'm probably going to go ahead and end the stream here. My phone is kind of peening up a bit, so... I'll probably go ahead and end the stream. But at least the thing I like about doing live streams on the phone is just, you just press the resume button, so... That's nice. So yeah, CCA Productions, if you can uh, do the shatter, shatter the Crystal walkthrough, I would really appreciate that. I would definitely watch it. It would help a lot <laughs> um, on finding the crystals that I might be missing. So, But uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead in the stream. The phone's kind of heating up, so uh, I'll see you guys uh, whenever. I honestly don't know when the next stream will be. Um, I might try and do one next weekend. Maybe. I don't know. But uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Bye.